What's up guys, it is Chris back with another watch video and today I have news from Brew. Brew is a small micro brand located out of New York. They make watches that are inspired by coffee and obviously retro designs. They came out with a really appealing retro designed Mecha Quartz Chronograph and that is the metric and this gets a very retro look with a retro bracelet and dial. These are really nicely proportioned as well. 36 millimeters by 41.5 millimeters. It's sort of an integrated bracelet look. 10.75 millimeters thick. That's because we're getting a Mecha Quartz movement in here. Lug width is 20 millimeters. I believe you can actually use straps on this watch even though it has that sort of integrated bracelet look. You're getting a sapphire crystal. It's all stainless steel. Uh, and you're also getting a folding clasp with micro adjustment, which is nice on here. So it gets a traditional folding clasp, not a butterfly. So you could actually get a little bit of micro adjustment. The thing about this is the dials. The dials on here are really very, very nicely executed. The dial on the black version is really the one to go for. It gets some really nice aqua blue accents on the minute track, a little bit of yellow also on that minute track down at the bottom. There are two sub registers. Those sub registers are actually sunken just a little bit into the dial. You have a black dial overall with the logo there at three o'clock. You're getting yellow hands on here, a combination of yellow and stainless steel look on these that match the applied indices. You're also getting a orange second hand. So a lot of color going on on the dial. However, it is not a ton of color that actually overpowers the watch. You're getting primarily a black dial and then there's just one sub dial with some orange accents that's between the nine and 10 o'clock or nine and 11 o'clock area. Really a very nice chronograph, sort of a square shape. There is also a second version that's a silver dial and the silver dial just gets a few blue accents uh, on the hands and on that sub register and that's really it. Uh, the black dial has already sold out on their website. This was very, very popular. They're going to be restocking these. These are going to be delivered in August. So this is uh, for delivery at the end of this month. Uh, however, the silver dial is still available. It reminds me a little bit of a yacht timer sort of look, uh, however, in a very retro 70s integrated bracelet case. Very interesting looking watch. Uh, and I'm not sure how this would actually look on a strap unless that strap was specifically designed for the watch, but I think you can use uh, interchangeable straps with this. Very thin watch, 10.75 as I mentioned, uh, and I just like the overall look. That's why I wanted to do a quick news video and let you guys know about it. Um, and then of course, in future, hopefully that black dial becomes available again because I think that's really the one to go for uh, if you like this look. Also, just to mention, the price on here is $395, so it's not an astronomical amount of money. Uh, yes, there are Mecha Quartz chronographs out there that are cheaper than this. However, not as many that have this much style. I think original design and inspiration from the 70s, a really awesome dial with a lot of inspiration from the 70s, a lot of color. Uh, if you're into that, this is a really good price. Under $400 is a really good price for this watch, in my opinion. But like I said, tell me what you guys think in the comments below. I want to hear from you guys. Please also don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell icon. It is super helpful for the channel and I very much appreciate it. Please follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is watchchrisblog. I have some links in the description. Those links are to Amazon. If you click those links and buy anything, it helps support the channel. It doesn't cost you anything extra. However, I very much appreciate it. Anyway, thank you for logging on. I'll catch you guys in the next video.